This military report is brought to you by Coleman University. Many San Diego veterans have dodged bullets, bombs, only to become another target while trying to use the GI Bill once they leave the service. 10 News military reporter Bob Lawrence with the dedication of a new center designed to help veterans fight back. The ships come in and Marines come back. And for many who want to leave the service and use their GI Bill to go to school. So they've got a huge target on their back. Robert Muth, a former judge advocate in the Marine Corps, is talking about for-profit schools. Business Insider in a survey done in March called them, quote, a spectacularly bad investment. Veterans who sign an enrollment agreement are often stuck. It turns out a lot of them have been subject to essentially fraud, where they've been recruited by you know, very aggressive recruiting tactics, bringing them into the school, and then it turns out that those promises are unfulfilled. That's where USD's new Veterans Legal Clinic comes in to go over those agreements before they're signed or to see if there's something that can be done afterwards. We can represent th those veterans in trying to get their GI Bill funds back and then also to make sure that other veterans aren't subject to the same abusive practices. Whether it's a legal issue or a myriad of other problems that crop up during transition, the key is having a central place to get questions answered. Like scores before him, T.J. Ortega got out of the Navy and wanted to use his GI Bill to go to school. This is the first time in your life where you, there was no one telling you what to do. It's on you to take care of it. His first stop, the SDSU Vet Center. I was able to walk in, take care of my post-11 GI Bill. Um, if I didn't have it started, we, um, they would actually show me how to get started. Getting out of the service means a lot of choices to make the right one. You, you actually have to turn to another veteran and say, hey, what did you do? Exactly what these centers are designed for. Bob Lawrence, 10 News. USD's legal clinic is free and it's open to all veterans. And for contact information, just click on the red television button on 10news.com.